Deep in the bowels of an old power plant, a sinister plot is hatching. Ha ha! At last the time has come to hatch my sinister plot! This lever will activate my blackout generator and the world will be thrown into eternal night! Not so fast, doctors! What? <gasps> Pajama Man! That's right, Fiend! And I have some gadgets of my own! Take that! Ah! Not the Illuminator Mark V! Do you have anything to say before you're sucked into my portable bad guy containment unit? I wish you'd pick up your socks once in a while. Sure thing, Mom. You can consider that done. Okay, Sam. You remember tonight's the night we go to sleep with the lights off. Don't worry about me, Mom. I'm ready. And I can put on my pajama Sam mask if I get scared. That's good, dear. Good night, Sam. Good night, Mom. There's no need to hide when it's dark outside. No need to hide when it's dark outside. I'm not scared. Darkness lives in my closet, but that's okay. I'm not scared. Okay, I'm scared. I can't sleep with darkness hanging around in my closet. I'm gonna have to capture him. This is a job for... Pajama Sam! Now where's my Pajama Sam mask? I need that and my flashlight and my lunchbox. I'm sure that my stuff's in here somewhere. Bunch of socks, nothing good. Aha! My trusty flashlight! This will help me capture darkness. Now I just need my mask and my lunchbox. Darkness is in my closet, but I can't go in until I find my mask and my lunchbox. one of my socks. Mom said I should pick these up. This is where I'll put all the socks I find. Nothing there. Nothing good under there. And introducing... That's Pajama Man. He's my hero. edition all metal pajama man lunchbox who threw this away i can keep darkness in here after i capture him now i just have to find my mask oh here's my pajama sam mask gotta protect my secret identity okay i'm ready to go into my closet and capture darkness all right i'm ready for action all right, darkness, here comes Pajama Sam! Hello? Is anybody in here? Darkness? Hello? Darkness lives all right. I better go find him before Mom notices I'm gone. Well, there's no turning back now. Boy, I had no idea my closet was this big on the inside. Hey, a board. It's too far to reach. Another sock. I better pick it up like Mom said. 
I should match up these socks. Looks like I need to find a total of 10 pairs of socks. I, um... I think we better confiscate these items. They could be dangerous. Hey, I need those. And you're traveling in disguise. Let's see what you really look like. Hmm? My pajama Sam mask. Pajama Sam, eh? Well, all right, then, pajama Sam. You can go, but I've got my eye on you. <laughs> Uh-oh. Now what do I do? Another sock! You can borrow that if you like. Uh, thanks. I feel bad about you losing your things. Yeah, how am I supposed to capture darkness without all my stuff? Well, I'm sure your things are here in the land of darkness somewhere. If you look around, you might be able to find them again. I hope so. I'll bring you back your rope later, okay? Good luck. That scary looking place up there must be Darkness's house. I'll bet that's where I'll find him. So what do you know, another sock? I'm Pajama Sam. I'm gonna capture Darkness and put him in a lunchbox. That's great. My name's Mud. Really? No, not really. Then why did you say it is? Look, I, I'm sorry, kid. I'm just real depressed is all. See, I, I used to roll all over the place on this here track. Up, down, sideways, loop the loop. All the fun I had. But then I got rushed. Rust? Yeah, rust. See, my wheels are rusted stiff, so I'm stuck right here on this spot. Can't move at all. Gee, that's too bad. Yeah, especially in summer when the pigeons come down here for some shade. That looks like one of Dad's socks. I wonder how it got here. Hi! Hello! My name's Sam. I'm going to capture darkness and put him in a metal lunchbox. After I find my lunchbox, I mean. Oh, well, pleased to meet you, Sam. You can call me Otto. I like cheese. Hey, who doesn't? Would you give me a ride across the river? Oh, no! I can't go in the water. I'd sink. I made of wood, you know. But wood floats. No, I don't think so. I had this friend and he told me this story about his dentist brother who, um, he was made of wood and he got in the water and he sank. Really? Straight to the bottom. It's so scary. I wish I'd been a car. I think your friend was wrong. Wood floats in the water. Oh, I wish that were true. Yep, this is Darkness's house, all right. Yeah. 
There's no mail. Beat it. These are pretty heavy. Wow, physics. I can't capture darkness until I find a... Nice tree's not too mad that I lost a rope. At least I got this great piece of wood. Okay, check this out. It's wood, right? Yes. All right, now watch. See? It floats. Wood floats. Yeah? So you'll float too. Go on, give it a try. I guess. Huh? Well, so far, so good. Well, here goes nothing. Floating! Yahoo! Oh boy, this is great! Can I give you a ride somewhere? Come on, hop in! Oh. Let's go sailing! Well, technically we can't do that since I'm not a sailboat because I don't have a sail. I know what you mean, but technically you should say, let's go floating or something like that. Sure, sure, whatever you say. Let's go sailing! Okay. Neat! An old hollow log! Maybe there's a frog in it or something. Rats, there's nothing in here at all. Uh-oh, I think I'm stuck. Yes, I'm definitely stuck. I wonder how Pajama Man would handle this. Phew, it's hot in there. Bye, Otto. I'll be back soon. Okay, I'll leave the meter running. Huh? Well, um, I had this friend, and he's a taxi, and... Okay, bye-bye now, bye-bye. My name's Sam. How nice. Hold! Just where do you think you're going? Um, nowhere really. I just wanted to pass by. Just barging through like that? Without even asking permission? Have you no manners? It is customary. Oh no, this isn't another customs inspection, is it? Are you gonna take all my stuff? I assure you, we have no interest in your stuff. Phew, that's a relief. I'm sorry if I offended you. May I pass through? No. No? This is an exclusive road. It's for trees only. Yes, trees only. Now, be off with you. Look at me, I'm 
crazy loghead boy. Whoop. Uh, tree coming through. Good day to you, fellow tree. Whew, hot in there. Is that my pajama Sam mask? This mask belongs to the people. It sure looks like my mask. Property is theft, man. Anyway, I need the mask to protect my identity as the leader of the Salad Liberation Front. The what? The Salad Liberation Front. We're a group of veggies fighting against the core system. We're tired of being relegated to the salad. We want to be the main course. Whatever. I just want my mask back. I'll tell you what. The other carrots are being held prisoner in the refrigerator in Darkness's kitchen. If you help me free the carrots, I'll give you back the mask. Okay, it's a deal. Great. I'll come with you to the kitchen so I can direct the operation. Okay, sure. Hey, Penny! I wish. I wish the grass were greener here. Why are you wishing? I threw the penny in. Who's the wishing well here, you or me? Oh. My name's Sam. You can call me Cal Nibonics. Where'd you get a name like that? I didn't say it was my name. I just said you could call me that, if you want to. Oh, uh, thanks. Hey, I got another sock! I guess I better put my ingenious disguise back on. Whoa! Good day, fellow tree. And a good day to you as well. to cross the bridge to see what's on the other side. Don't try to butter me up. If you want to go across, you'll have to pay a toll. How much is the toll? One pound of gold. Open the store, there's no knob on it. It's an oil can. And there's some oil in it. Hey, I got another sock. Oh. Hey, that's my flashlight. My flashlight's in there. Oh, 
ultra-edition all-metal pajama man lunch box. Were we looking for that? Yeah! I needed to put darkness in when I captured her. It's my portable bad guy containment unit, just like pajama man. Oh, I see. Rat, can't reach it. Darn, I can't reach it. Gotta get it out of there before it rusts. I thought you said it was made of metal. Right, metal stuff rusts if you leave it underwater. Really? Well, I guess you were right about the wood thing. That looks like one of my big brother Mark's socks. Smells like one too. Um, sure. Fun. Right. Yeah, that was fun! Let's do it again! Um, how about not right away, okay? There's another sock! Here, I think maybe this might help your wheels. Say, that's good. Now do the back, huh? I'm king of the tracks again, thanks to you, kid. Hey, what'd you say your name was? Sam. Well, listen, Sam, the king owes you big time. Anytime you need a ride through the mines, the king will take you. <laughs> Don't even bother, kid. It's a one-way door. What are you going to do with that? You'll see. Okay, you be careful with it, yeah? By the way, what is this thing? It's a pickaxe for mine and gold. Oh, yeah. Ha <laughs> ha 
you to be careful. Yeah, but look at all this gold I got. Since you're fabulously rich, uh, how about sharing the wealth a little? Say, let me have the small piece, huh? Deal. That's too high. We can't get back up there. Go. This should be at least a pound. All right, you're clear. Go on across. Avarti. I'm fine, how are you? No, 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 I said Havarti. Don't you know how to play cheese and crackers? Mom told me I shouldn't play with my food. No, cheese and crackers is the name of a game, see? Come on, mm. I'll show you how to play. Hey, this is like tic-tac-toe. Tic-tac-hoo? No, no, this is cheese and crackers. Pay attention. First, you need to choose which you're gonna be, the cheese or the crackers. The cheese, of course. Okay, I'll be the crackers. You're trying to get three of your cheeses in a row before I get three crackers in a row. You go first. Now, you move. Where should I move? Darn you one. 
I'll beat you next time. Hold it! If you're planning on coming back, I'll have to stamp your hand. Oh, okay. You wouldn't believe how many people try to cheat me. Thanks. No problem. I can float now, you know. Oh. These are pretty heavy. This basket has enough weight in it already. must be the way up into Darkness's house. <laughs> I guess I weigh more than one stone. anymore. Maybe I should turn on the music again. Well, I guess that's not gonna work. Hello? Okay, I don't see him anymore. Hello, and welcome to The Brain Tickler, the game where you get to show how smart you really are. Actually, I just wanted to go through. I think we can arrange that, can't we, Wink? That's right, Blink, but you'll have to answer a few questions first, because as you know, no one can pass through the doors of knowledge without first playing The, the Brain Tickler. Tickler. our first contestant. What's your name, son? Uh, it's Sam. He's Sam, all the way from, well, wherever it is he's from. His interests include skydiving, channeling ancient spirits, and stamp collecting. I don't collect stamps. You're making that up. And he'll be playing today for the right to pass through the doors of knowledge. He'll be asked questions from four categories. Once he's correctly answered one question from each of the categories, he wins. And we all know what that means, right, Wink? Step right over here, Sam, and select your first category. Our categories today are worms, cosmology, 
fruits and the land of darkness. I'll take fruits, please. All right, here is your question. What color is an orange? Orange. That's correct. Wow! That's one category down and three to go. You're doing well. Go ahead and choose another category. Let me try cosmology. All right, here is your question. How long does a manicure... Oh, I'm sorry, that's a cosmetology question. How is a star formed? A whole lot of space gas catches on fire. Yes, that's essentially correct. Two down, two to go. All right, which of the remaining two categories would you like to try next? Let me try worms, please. All right, here is your question. Which worm is a favorite food among mammals, birds, reptiles, and carnivorous invertebrates? The mealworm. You are absolutely right. You're Jeez. really on the roll now. Are you ready for your final category? Um, uh, uh, I'll take the land of darkness. All right, here is your question. What is the reading on the water meter located in the mines near Darkness's house? Can I try again later? Oh. But hey, you can always go have a look, right? That's right. So go ahead and pick a category. I'll take the land of darkness. All right. Here is your question. What is the reading on the water meter located in the mines near Darkness's house? Gee, I don't think I've ever been over there. Oh. But hey, you can always go have a look, right? That's right. So go ahead and pick a category. Can we take a break and I'll come back later? Of course we can. Because there's always time for the Brain Tickler. We'll be back after a few short messages. Oh my gosh, darkness must be right behind this door. There's another sock. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Ow! Won't you open the door since I have another victim? What? I surrender, not ever. Oh, wait. Now I see. You now have captured that troublesome carotter guy. I'll open up my door so you can put that rogue inside my drawer. Oh no, our orange leader was caught. Our fight for our freedom for not we are diminished. Completely finished. Carrot. Hey guys, don't you see he's with me and you're free to go. Free! Yes, free! Free! Uh-huh! Free! 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 I almost forgot this, but you've earned it. You have taken the tide and turned it. You may take this mask and wear it. A gift of gratitude from this carrot. Bye.
Hooray, I finally have my mask. Two more things and I finish my task. That's a no-no, we avow it. No, we simply can't allow it. Going down. Sam. <laughs> Don't even bother, kid. It's a one-way door. What's this thing? Well, that's a water meter. It says Welcome back to the Brain Tickler, ladies and gentlemen. As you'll recall from before the commercial break, our contestant Sam was about to select a category. Our categories today are the Land of Darkness. I'll take the Land of Darkness. All right, here is your question. What is the reading on the water meter located in the mines near Darkness's house? 844. That's absolutely right! You've done your homework. You correctly answered questions from all four categories. That makes you the new Brain Tickler Grand Champion! Congratulations, Sam! Gee, thanks! Dom Perignon, tell us what he's won! Blink, as the new Grand Champion, Sam has won the right to pass through the doors of knowledge anytime he chooses. Isn't that fantastic? You mean I can go through right now if I want to? That's right. Wow. Thank you for being here with us on The Brain Tickler. Until next time, this is Wink and Blink saying good night. Wink and Blink's wardrobe was provided by the One Coat Paint Company. Yikes! The doorknob came off. I didn't do it. I barely touched it. A 
I don't believe I can eat that cheese, Sam. What did one clover say to the other clover? Take me to your weeder! Pumpkinhead Boy, A Brief Tragedy Once upon a time, there was a boy who had a pumpkin for a head. But then his lawyers told him to lose the pumpkin because they feared a lawsuit by that big guy in Atlanta. And they were concerned about seasonality, so he lost the pumpkin and then he was blue. The end. I think I've heard that story before. The Book of Clues when seeking answers, use your head. You must push in only red. Whoa, that looks like a secret door. I don't see any way to open it. I think I saw something on the other side of the door. I saw something on the other side of the door. Wow! This is like a secret mad scientist lab or something! This must be one of those dumb waiter things that's like a little elevator for food. I bet I could ride this one right back up to the kitchen. This must go back up to the kitchen. Impressive trick! No wonder he's the grand champion! I can't go in there without my lunchbox and my flashlight. Oh! Oh! I just don't see why it always has to be you who reads the question. I deserve to read half of the question. It's just because I have a better... Oh, shh! Sh it's the grand champion. Ow! 
Good evening, Mr. Grand Champion! Hi! A visitor! <laughs> well, oh well, well. We don't get many visitors around here. How do you do? Pretty well, thanks. How about all of you? We're fine. Thank you for asking. I'm not. In fact, I'm downright downbeat. Oh? How come? Because I ain't got no body. <laughs> I need the mask so I can turn into... Sure to come in handy. doesn't have a handle. I wonder what this button does. Hey, look at that, would ya? Howdy, Sam. Hi, King. Oh, wait. This doorknob should fit the door. Once again, Pajama Sam saves the day with his mighty brain. The door is stuck. I think the hinges are rusty. These hinges look kind of rusty. I better oil them. That did the trick. I can't reach it from here. Now I just have to get my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox and I'll be all set. Darkness, watch out! Huh? Ah! 
Hey, I've got an idea. What are you gonna do with that? Magnets attract metal, you know. Oh no, I don't think they do. If I had this friend and well, what do you know? I got my lunchbox! Alright! Watch out, darkness! Pajama Sam is ready to roll! Um, how about not right away, okay? Bye, Otto. I'll be back soon. The Grand Champion! Good evening, Mr. Grand Champion! Hi! Okay, this is it. This is the big one. Alright, I'm ready! It is I, Pajama Sam! I have come to vanquish you! Hello, Darkness? The closet! He's in the closet! What do you know, another sock! That's 20 socks! Mom's gonna be so proud of me! I told Mom I'd pick up my socks! Locked. Maybe this one is the right key. No, not that one. Still locked. Still locked. Let me try this key. Nope. Okay, one more time. This time, I'm really gonna get darkness. No. Aha! This must be the key. Aha! This key works! Okay, that's that. Now I'm ready to go into Darkness's closet and capture him! Watch out, Darkness! Here comes Pajama Sam! Darkness? It is I, Pajama Sam! I've come to vanquish you! Vanquish? Is that fun? I'm going to capture you and lock you in my signature additional Metal Pajama Man lunchbox. Oh dear, that doesn't sound like fun at all. Why would you want to put me in a box? So I won't have to be scared of you anymore? You're scared? I'm the one who's going to be stuck in the box. Oh 
here. No one ever wants to come over and play fun games with me. You like to play games? Yes, but I never have anyone to play with. At night, when I come out, everybody's asleep. You mean you don't have any friends? Well, no. I like to play games. Really? Do you like to play cheese and crackers? Do I? I played it with a toaster in the park. It's great. Oh, good. We, we just need some, some, some crackers and, and some tasty cheese. Look at that move, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah? Hey, what do you know? I defeated darkness. Oh, I didn't see that one. You win. You're good at this, Sam. Thanks. I like this game. I better go home now, though. My mom might get worried. Okay, maybe we can play some more tomorrow night. Okay. Sam, are you all right in there? Fine, Mom. Good night. Good night, dear. <sighs> Good night, darkness.